This is Smallsy Surgery. Are you ready? Let's go on, let's go on night. You're on air with Smallsy. Hey, um, tonight on the show, I'm going to try this out. I don't know how this is going to go. This is either going to go, this is going to be the best thing ever. It's going to give me a radio award or it's going to lend me, end me in a meeting tomorrow saying, Smallsy, you cannot talk about raw dogging at 7.30. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> Strap in, everybody. There's a new trend going around that everyone needs to be aware of because you may be guilty of raw dogging yeah. without even knowing you're raw dogging. Now, it started. It, it started in uh, the tra- in like travel in the travel area, but it's slowly uh, spinning out across a whole bunch of people's lives. And I would like to know if you are a raw dogger. The phone lines are open. 13, 24, 10. Do you raw dog it? Here's where the trend started. It turns out people have been going on, like, long plane flights, okay, and then not taking their AirPods or headphones, not taking a book, and then not watching any in-flight movie entertainment. They will sit in the airplane chair for eight hours straight, just staring straight ahead... And they're calling that raw dogging. I couldn't think of anything worse. However, I'm also a raw dogger, I've realised. My name is Smallsy. I like to raw dog. When it comes to the gym, apparently if you go to the gym or if you do any exercise, maybe you go for a run, I don't like running with listening to music. Some people run with, like, headphones on or earphones. I run raw dog style. I just run au naturel. No no noise whatsoever. Let's open up the phones. 13, 24, 10. Are you a raw dogger? Are you one of these people that sits on a plane, doesn't watch the in-flight entertainment? Do you go to the gym and, like, not listen to your own music? Do you go for a run and not listen to any music? But I can give you some more examples. Would you like some more, yeah, raw, give us a few more. more raw dog examples? If you use public transport... And you don't listen to music, you just sit there and, like, look at other people. You're a raw dogger. Are you a... La- hey, lady, ladies, ever left the house without makeup on? You're a raw dogger. Um, what about this one? Here you go. I've got another one for you. You ready? What about you go to the supermarket... And you don't take a bag with you. Oh. You just, you plan to carry it all in your hands. Raw dog. That's what you are. You're a dirty raw dogger. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Should we try this? 13, yeah. 13, 24, 10. Are you also, what? maybe you're raw dogging something and you don't even realize, you want to share with me what you think a raw dogging is. Go. Lines are open. Do you, do you not listen to music? Do you go to the supermarket? You don't take a bag? Do you leave the house makeup free? Wow. Welcome to Raw Doggin' everybody. Do you do it? Catherine, welcome to the show. Hey. Welcome to the show, you raw dogger you. <laughs> I was getting worried when you said you were gonna get into trouble tomorrow at some uh, about talking about raw dogging. Yeah, I don't know, Catherine. Like, you you seem like this about. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Talk to me. You, what, what are you raw dogging? So I'm a raw dog runner. Raw dog runner, okay. What are we? What are we not doing? We're not using headphones, uh, or no, no headphones, no nothing. My sister tries to talk to me when she comes along, and I'm like, no, nah, zip it, zip just it. Let me run and just let me do me. You know what? I'm also going to put into the raw dog runner the, those people who go barefoot running. You know, there's, oh, a, there's, no. a, there's a trend of people. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Apparently, it's good to touch the ground for energy. Yeah, nah. For your no, energy. No, no, no. I need those energy. things on my face. Yeah, no, I'm, <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a raw dog runner with you, Catherine. Hey, you know, is there a raw dog radio? Oh, my God. <laughs> Should we do raw dog radio? No music underneath me. Very cro- creepy and silent. Silent. Hello, Sophie. You also... Hi, gi- w- what are you gymming at the gym and raw dog? So I go to the gym and dance class with no water bottle. Oh, you can't do that. That's a raw dog right there. That's a raw... You know what? I thought you were going to say no towel. And then I was like, that's a real raw dog move. Hang on. So you go to a big gym class, big, big aerobics, no water bottle. Yeah. That's that. You're living a dangerous life there, Sophie. I know. When I you, know. When you come out parched or anything, you good? Yeah. No, nah, you good? Okay, great. Awesome. Thank you. Hello, Martine. Hi, you how got, are you? you got two sisters who love a raw dog, I hear. 
Yeah, so a few weeks ago this term came up and they were talking about raw-dogging their ADHD medication. <laughs> what you... <laughs> and I've noticed that in the neurodivergent community on a few posts I've been following recently that mm. there is quite a few people that raw-dog their ADHD meds. Yeah, no, okay. apparently if you're on meds, right, if you have to take meds, yeah. now this is not med- medical advice, speak to your doctor, but yeah. just stop taking them. Welcome to Raw Doggin. <laughs> see, what, see what happens. That's that can't be good for your your two sisters. Just oh no, you're allowed to have time off, and some, it depends on what kind of medication you've got as well. So yeah. sometimes people just take it when they need it. So yeah. they call it Raw Doggin. Your sisters just <laughs> get, walk into the hello family for this week. We shall be Raw Dogging <laughs> our medication. <laughs> Thank you very much. By the way, if anyone else, 13, 24, 10, any other areas in your life you think you can raw dog? Feel, well, let's cooking. Th- what do you mean cooking? Yeah, you know, stop measuring ingredients, bit of this, bit of that. What? That's crazy, you raw dogger. That's crazy. <laughs> cooking without measuring said ingredients? Forget the recipe, just throw it in. Oh, cooking without a recipe, <laughs> raw dog. We're talking raw dogging right now. All started out by sitting in a plane chair for like 10 hours, not watching any in-flight entertainment. Before you know it, Chris and Glenn Iris, you just raw-dogging Hello. life, aren't you, bro? I am indeed. What are you raw-dogging? What are you doing? Look, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm a gardener and sometimes I'll get home from, uh, from work from a long day and I'll sit on the couch and I'll, I'll fall asleep and then I'll jump into bed and wake up the next morning and go straight to work in my work uniform. That's just raw-dogging it. That's raw-dogging it, just skipping the shower. You know what? I'm guilty <laughs> of that too. Just miss the shower. Get finish the gym. Sorry, what? Finish the gym. Just go. You know, oh, I'm a bit depressed. Don't have, don't have the don't energy. To, don't have the energy to shower. Just raw dog it <laughs> straight into work. That's, That's it. what no, I, I do. That's what I do. Had a shower today though. Thank first, you. First day of the late drive show. Can have to have to smell my best. Hello, Amy. Hi. Hello. You're a big raw dogger, I right hear. I am. <laughs> I just I had a birthday yesterday, so I'm 44. Well, happy birthday, Amy, what? the 44 Thank year old raw dogger. What are you up oh, to? No, no makeup. Get out! <laughs> Someone at your age shouldn't leave the house without <laughs> something on their face. Joking. I know, right? <laughs> just, is it liberating? Just raw dog and life, just leaving the house without any makeup on. Oh, it just makes life so much easier. <laughs> Do you just not care anymore, Amy? Is it just like you know, I'm 44? Yeah, I'm done. Just, I've given yeah. up. What for? <laughs> this is me. Take me or leave me. <laughs> Take it or leave it. This is what I look like. God bless you, yep. Amy. Smallsy Surgery is a Nova podcast. For more great shows like this, head to novapodcast.com.au.